Coming up next, it's a UFC heavyweight division collision. Well, this is exciting here, DC. The founder of Jeet Kune Do, one of the founding fathers, really, of mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is back in a big spot here tonight. Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed. It was the charisma. It was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special. And tonight, he's going to look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done. And if you hear the phrase, drillers make killers, right? I mean, that was Bruce Lee in a nutshell. He felt like practice yes, would make yes. perfect. Nobody trained as hard as the great Bruce Lee. Well, pretty much every time out in the UFC, DC, this man has put on a striking clinic, and that is his methodology coming in here tonight. He'll try to keep the fight on the feet. And that's why we tune in, right? That's why we tune in. We tune in to see guys that are dynamic. We tune in for the speed. We tune in for the knowledge of the striking game, the ability to set traps, the ability to find the jab, the ability to find the right hand, the right kick, the left kick, the knees, the elbows. He truly uses every weapon that he has in his arsenal to try and finish his opponents. You make one mistake, night's over. You cannot make mistakes against a guy that has the striking acumen yep. of this guy right here. And the jab is not as underutilized a weapon as it was in MMA, say, five or seven years ago, but he's got as good a jab as anyone in the business, and that is where all of his striking flows off of. We'll see how it goes for him in this matchup tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City, Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, USA, Bruce the Dragon Lee. And now introducing his opponent, Fighting out of the red corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet ten inches tall, weighing in at 211 pounds. Fighting out of Lee Summit, Missouri, Razor. All right, great to lose in the locker room. I want you to bring up your hands at all times, protect yourself at all times. On a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, so back to your corners, come out fighting. Square Garden, this arena, not synonymous with winning when it comes to the NBA's New York Knicks, but certainly there have been a lot of big UFC moments here over the last year. No championship for the Knicks, but ah. when we fight here, somebody gets to take home a beautiful gold belt. Tonight, let's see how you perform in the world's greatest arena. Lee gets caught with that punch. Oh, that'll ring your bell. Head kick. Ah, oh, that jab hurt him. Oh. Straight right. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the judge. Good punch land. Man, how good is his right hook count? Oh, right leg. 
left combo by Lee. Strong defense here as the hook to the head is blocked. Really timing his shots nicely. Good tempo, very accurate, finding the range with relative ease. Yeah, he's doing a great job of really overwhelming his opponent with activity. Oh, that's a big hook to the chin. Whips on that offering. Just over three minutes to go round one. Connects with a punch there, DC. You gotta like what you're seeing thus far. I mean, the speed at which he throws is crazy. Hardy closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. Liver kicks. If you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Lee gets tattooed with that hook. He's gonna have to change some things here. So a huge knockout victory for that fighter here tonight. Well, another highlight for the real DC as we look back at that scintillating knockout. Yeah, but the whole fight, he was landing great strikes, kicks, punches. He was doing everything right until eventually he found the shot that ended the fight. And there he is, all smiles. What a huge knockout he turned in here tonight. That is one they'll be talking about for some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bergliotta has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 19 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Razor. All right, so there he is, the man of the moment, celebrating one of the bigger knockout victories of his career. And got to be nice sometimes with all the hard work that you guys put in when it goes down exactly the way you drew it up. A lot of people talk about doing certain things. It's harder to deliver on those promises you make to the public Tonight, he did exactly that. Congratulations. 